Oh, okay, back to our regularly scheduled programming. Right. Cool. Let's get going, shall we? So he just got there and those big ass things are trying to kill him. <laughs> So cute. Ah, what do we do? He's not like the big softies just now. He's in gym for a fight. Proper savage. Uh oh. Let's run away. No, you start to run away. Give him a whacking and send him packing. Huh? Give huh? him a whacking. Ah, send him packing. Look, Langley, he's making his move. Just hit him with that little stick. <gasps> dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Our first battle. It's a rough. Oh, he's That's scratching. It's a flareon. Okay, how do I. Just attack him? Okay. Don't fret, holy boy. Let your old companion talk you through the basics of battle. Alright, so I've got green gauge for my health. Healthier R if I have more HP. Blue gauge for MP. We're not going to do any magic so far. There's the rough. He has the sun sign. So there's, I know there's three signs. That's his HP. Sun, moon, and stars. And they all like are one's better than the other. Rock, paper, scissors style. All right, let's give him a smack with the stick. Bam. This is gonna be funny. <laughs> this is like beating a dog. I guess it's attacking. Okay, so I have to wait until... Uh, he dropped something. How do I get it? Oh, I can just run to it. Cool. A glim! Enemies drop one in the heat of battle. Green glims are the one... Store my HP and blue do 8 MP. Alright. Particular's word, not having any more. Alright, let's just beat on this dog, I guess. Poor dog. He missed me. Haha. -ha. Smacked him a few times. So, like, this timer go. There we go. Oh, Well, he boofed into smoke. Drippy's just like, all right, you just do that. I'll hang out over here. <laughs> <laughs> Hide in the tall grass. That dog had three gold on him. Well, hey, tidy. Nice one, <laughs> you learned how to beat a dog with a stick. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Our world is absolutely riddled with beasts. <laughs> and you'll have nothing to worry about. Right, let's get a move on. We? You can beat most of them with a stick, sure, but uh, should have told you that. Where are we going? Well, first off, we need to get you a wand. But I already have a wand. You're having a laugh, are you? That thing's about as magical as a flipping cabbage. You might just squeeze a gateway spell out of it, but you can forget about anything more than that. Honestly, I wish you'd think before you open your mouth. Oh, sorry. You should know all this already, oh, somehow. Ding dong dell was just over by yonder, didn't I? <laughs> well, if we're very lucky, we might find a wand with a bit more ding dong over there. Dell. Yep. So Mr. Drippy wants to lead you to so ding dong dell. <laughs> Time was you couldn't move for the flipping thing. But since Shada showed up, magic's taken a real nose down. No, oh, she is Morgan Freeman's voice. It, Time was. Tried to. He scared them all so much they gave it up. So, he's pretty scary, huh? Well, he turned me into a flipping doll, didn't he? Just saying his name's enough to make most folks <gasps> prick it. Still, I'd rather be a doll than have him go poking round in my heart. No one wants to be broken hearted. Luckily, he made the mom make it in the other world. Worse than that, much Aww. worse. It's when he steals a piece of a person's <laughs> heart. Poor beggars Zombies. don't know whether they're alive or dead. That's no way to live, man. It's like so Mono. That's why all so scared of him, huh? We can't let him go on doing this. <laughs> it's not a matter of letting him, is it? It's not like people flipping enjoy it. That's why I brought <laughs> his glance, Danielle's picture. <laughs> You really think I can? Of course you can! You are the pure-hearted one! And the legends say that the pure-hearted one will drive away the darkness! We'll teach you a few tasty spells and you'll be ready to face mm. it in no time! So Delicious spells. You. Okay, Tidy. I'll do it. I'll learn magic. Tidy. Throw your pants down, you please. That's why we need to find you a better wand! Why 
Why does it upset me? Let's head for Ding Dong Dell. Well, you say that now, but if we get caught in some type of like rainstorm, he's gonna want those pants rolled up. It upsets me so. Whoa! Ain't a beautiful Ollie boy. Ah, oh, it's good to be back. Aw, a little rough. It's riddled with monsters. Should have told you this before he came, but you know. If one of them spots you, you'll see a big exclamation mark pop over its head and it'll charge. When it gets within touching distance, you'll have to f fight on your hands. If you run out HP in the middle of battle, you'll be out of the count, so be careful in it. And there's a tidy little trick technique for you. If you sneak up behind him, you can get the first hit in, earthbound style. The only thing is, it works the other way around too, so if they sneak up on you, all right. Yeah, Earthbound style. Yeah, it's a little bit of something considered a gift from the High Lord, Lord of the Fatties. I got three loaves of white bread. That's fattening. It might pre have preservatives, in, or not preservatives. <laughs> dyes, or whatever. What do we do with these? To munch on one, you're feeling a bit ropey. And you'll be right as rain in no time, man. But a wizard cannot live by bread alone, holy boy. He needs a proper wand and all. And that knobbly thing <laughs> in your hand isn't doing it. Uh, boy, flip it in and... See that big castle in the north? I don't know That's... if Mr. Drippy should be uh, <laughs> evaluating anyone's wands. I reckon we'll find ourselves a wall by a wand by there, so let's get moving, shall we? Okay, let's go to Ding Dong Dell. Oh, what's this? There's something shiny over here. Um. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just charge it because it's gonna get to me. What is this thing? Oh my gosh, a sleepy what? fowl. Oh my goodness. Everything is so cute. Oh, I should have. I should have defended. Put me to sleep. Help me, Drippy. Drippy, what are you doing? You just backed away. Okay, I defended. He's just hitting me. I need to attack. Get him. Aw, he was pretty weak. Drippy just kind of circles the battlefield and jumps around. Man, that was a little tough. He put me to sleep like immediately. Get some experience. Alright, it's this thing over here. I got a bunch of booster shoots. What is that? Sure. Let's head for the castle, holy boy. Plenty of time for chatting once we get there. Alright. I had the soundtrack for, like, since the DS game came out, so... <laughs> Some of these songs are already in my head. I've been waiting for this forever. <laughs> oh, Nick, there's something I forgot to tell you. Well, what's that, Mr. Trippy? Here in my world, you can use R to change a viewpoint. If you're having trouble with the controls, go in the settings, fiddle with them. Alright, you can switch vibration on and off as well, ain't it? Speaking personally, I'd have it on! <laughs> a rumble just ain't a rumble without a bit of rumble, is it? <laughs> sure. I know this is a lot to take in, Ollie boy, but I'm sure you'll get used to it. I guess. I like to stick me wand up me arse and then rumble it. <laughs> That's just me personally. <laughs> Oh, some commotion back here as the guard just stretches. Uh-oh, look at that cat hat. Yeah, what's up with that? The guard's a furry. No. He also looks like he's about to pass out. Like a classic case of broken oh no. Broken you mean that he's been dumped? That's right. The broken hearted are people who've had part of their hearts stolen. Poor souls just aren't uh, themselves. Go all weird and useless uh, <laughs> so his heart was broken by... Shadar, isn't it? If anyone tries to stand up to him or does anything he doesn't like, he breaks their hearts into pieces so they can't put up a fight. Like a horcrux. But if he stays that way, we can't get into Ding Dong Dell. I could just punch him and take the keys. Then you better carry him in it, Ollie boy. It's time to mend your first broken heart. Mend it, but how do I do that? <laughs> well, you can't just do it just yet. There's a couple more things we'll be needing first. I know an old man who's just who's got just what we need. Proper useful, I am, eh? An old man? What old man? What do you mean? The... What old man? The old man, eh? It lives in the woods of the north here. Proper deep and deeply dark it is. That's why they call it the deep dark woods. Sure. Makes sense, I guess. Alright. I guess we're going there. He's stretching, at least, though. He's active. <laughs> well, he just beamed me. One, two, one, two. <laughs> oh, it went through my head the second time. You want to enter the town, do you? I'm afraid it's impossible at the moment. It's my colleague, you see. He's the one in charge of letting people in. But recently, 
He's just been refusing to do it. He says he can't be bothered. Now the guy's full of so much vim and vip, we should give it to the him. Sigh. Gangnam style. <laughs> What's going on here? You're just over there writing poetry. Can't keep us waiting. I swear the girl over there keeps looking at me. I hope they keep us out here a bit longer. Ooh. Which girl? Yeah. This little one? Oh. Ma'am, ma right. mama, I need to pee pee. Maybe it's her. Oh dear, I do hope they let us in soon. I need to buy the ingredients for my husband's favorite dinner. Well, she's married, so hopefully he's not talking about her. What girl does he mean? I've got to let us in. Mother will go spare if I'm late again. <laughs> that guy looks like Brock eyes. <laughs> this is a disgrace. I've been here for hours. Where are they going to let startling people in? One last guy. I wonder why they're not letting anyone in. Oh well, I'll just stand here instead of trying to help. Oh, I forgot this guy. It doesn't look like any of us are going anywhere in the near future. Okay, see you guys. <laughs> I wonder what girl he meant. Like, the lady who's married with a kid? 